Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the stream. Where's my webcam? There's my webcam. Hi, everybody. Just this. I'm going to continue with my tradition of never being actually prepared when I turn on the webcam for the first time. How's everybody doing? Welcome to the Friday stream, the Dark Soul stream, the Motor Ed stream, where we all gather to cheer on Motor Ed in his adventure to become the darkest soul of them all. Um, thank you, thank you everyone for coming in and watching. Frisk Keep, thank you for continuing a gift sub you got from Tashi Kikumaru. Uh, I gotta say straight off the bat, before we even get into this, um, y'all have already come out swinging on charity shirt buying. We sold like, we checked last night, only a few hours after posting the shirt designs, and we'd already sold like 400 shirts. It's insane. I don't even know what that number is today. We haven't looked. Oh, Julia, Julia said she's going to look it up. We'll find out what that number is today, but it's been so rad. Uh, you guys are incredible. That's already so much money for charity. So we're jazzed about that. For, for you guys that don't know, um, we made four, no, three, three and a half shirt designs uh, that we posted up on our store. And every shirt we sell, not just those designs, uh, we're going to be donating the proceeds to the Center for Black Equity uh, for the month of June. So if you're buying any shirts from us in the month of June, we'll donate those proceeds to the Center for Black Equity. They're an organization doing great work for LGBTQ plus people in the black community. So uh, feel free to buy shirts and give. It's really, really rad. Um, what else is there? How's everybody doing today? I'm seeing lots of Visney in the chat. <laughs> I love that Visney became a thing. <laughs> Happy Visney, everyone. Definitely check out the store. Kazdaroth, thank you for posting a link to the store. It's right there in the chat. There's also a link below the stream. You can go down and click one of them, one of them boxes. One of them boxes. Grayscale said, me and my friends are getting matching. Oh, it's Joy. Hello. That's Joy. I bet Joy would buy a shirt if she could. Joy would buy a shirt. Joy supports all people as long as they let her sit in their lap. Yeah. That's the one platform Here that, that Joy Here has. Here you go. Here's your handicap for the Dark Souls. Sorry. Oh my God. She's immediately started hitting my microphone cord. <laughs> Hi, Joy. Are you gonna stay here or are you gonna are you gonna move on down the road? What's your position? What's your position on this? She's still hitting my mic cord. She's really going at it. <laughs> She's having a good time. She's just kind of standing with her ass on me. Did you do that? Where are you going, buddy? <laughs> Where are you going? What's your game plan? What's your move? You can go anywhere you want. You can leave. This doesn't count. This is half leaving. Okay, she's gone. She's gone. She's gone. We've done it. Uh, you're getting some shirt compliments, Julia, from the chat. Thank you. That's the rocks I keep punching shirt. Dumby Queen said, I really want to get a shirt, but they don't ship to Europe. Oh. That sucks. I wonder why. That seems like... I saw someone in Germany bought it in Bulgaria. Weird. I wonder if it's like specific places. I don't know. I know s some Europeans were able to get shirts. Yeah, I keep getting Instagram messages about it. They shipped to UK. Uh, Garbage Boy asked, what does the subtle shirt design mean? It's uh, the word pride in Morse code. Disney. The open eyes are dots and the closed eyes are dashes. And if you put all the letters together, it makes pride. And the little stars are just space fillers. FF. It's the nerdy ninja wants me to tell you they think you're the coolest. <coughs> I drank my coffee wrong. Thank <coughs> you. I'm dying. Holy shit. What are we at? What's our numbers looking like? Um, I don't know exactly. Hold on. I gotta get out a calculator. I don't want to do mental math. Is there a... Like a part of our page we can look at 
numbers sold by day? Well, we've sold over 500 yesterday. But we I sold over 500 yesterday. Yeah, I could try to get a report. We're going to check it out, but it's really rad. Um, I'm going to play Dark Souls now. What do you think about that? Uh, can someone explain Visney, please? Um, so we were doing the the shirt with the, the Morse code. So if you read it from left to right in Morse code, it, it read pride as you went down. And so someone in the chat uh, rightfully brought up the fact that we should probably check what it reads as the other way. Like if you were to read it vertically to make sure it doesn't say anything like weird or bad accidentally. And it said Visney. So everyone has uh, been saying Visney rights now and happy Visney uh, as like a little fun code phrase. It's just a little fun we're having. We're just having a little fun thing. Um, I'm gonna start gaming while Julie's looking that up. Switch over to the gameplay camera. Switch over to the Dark Souls game. Make a Visney shirt. <laughs> I have to look into it before we did anything with it to make sure that VZNE doesn't also mean anything weird or bad. You never know what's going to mean something weird or bad in this in this world we live in. We live in the bad world. I actually um, updated my graphics card drivers and changed a couple settings that people said caused this game to slow down. And I think it's already feeling a lot smoother, actually. Which, that was definitely the reason that I lost last time, was because it wasn't, the frame rate wasn't exactly as smooth as I wanted. Minim nom nom, converted from a Twitch Prime sub to a tier one sub. Thank you so much. Okay, I have a number for everyone. The amount of merch we've sold since we posted the shirts, like, I don't know, what time did we post them? Like five, yeah, six yeah. o'clock It's yesterday? not even been 24 hours. It's not even been 24 hours. And we've sold over, well, we've sold exactly 554 merch things. Wow, so 554. All of the money we get from the merch sales in the month of June will be going to the Center for Black Equity. So thank you, everyone. That's flipping awesome. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah, that's, that's so already cool. like thousands of dollars. Yeah, it's it's oh, quite you. a bit. I forgot about you. I forgot about you, the a hole who hits me when I enter the room. I mean, listen, I'm gonna be real with y'all. We know I'm not gonna win it this time, right? We all know that's not gonna happen. My mic stand is driving me insane. Got to find a way to yeah. keep this thing up. Do you want to switch mics? No, now? it's fine. It'll work well enough for now. All right, this is the warm-up fight, so this doesn't count as the first attempt. This is the warm-up fight. Let's go. Oh, you did your little swippies, huh? You're coming out strong with your swippies right off the bat. Little swippies, little dashies, I love it. You love to see it. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. <laughs> I may have gotten marginally donked. I may have gotten a, a, a tad bit donked, but that was the warm up. That was the warm-up. I'm getting back in the, the swing of things. Are you investigating? I got it. Oh, Julia's figured out what's wrong with the mic stand. Julia's the handiest person I know. Sometimes we call her Hand Leah Le Petit. Don't. Don't call me that. Sometimes we call her Hand Leah because of how handy she is. Handy, handia. All right, 
this time I'm not going to get hit by the bad man. By the rude man. Julia's fixing the mic stand right now. Just going to wait a sec while that's going on. Oh, that's so much better. Julia, thank you. She yeah. did it. The secret, believe it or not, was a screw needed to be tighter. Yeah, this uh, nut was falling out. It was loose and, loose and goosen. It had a loose nut. You never want a loose nut. Loose nut. Let's go! I should have known. Let's go. Anime bullshit. Get that out of here. Sir. Got greedy. Gonna run away. Wow. It's fine. That's not fine. Come on. Staggered. Gotta run away. Run away, chug up. Don't do it. This is bad. 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 Uh, this time it was bad. It was bad on that one. It was a little bad on that one. But that doesn't like count as the first try though. Because that one, Julia had to fix the nut, the loose nut, so it wasn't official. I named the stream Jacob Beats Every Fight First Try No Problem. So I just want them to make sure they know that that wasn't the try, because you fixed the nut, so I had to, you know, it's different. It didn't count because there was a loose nut. There was a loose nut on the field. There was a play there on the loose, field. There was a loose, a loose nut loose on play, the field. Loose nut. No big hat equals big oof. <laughs> All right. The big hat has come through for us in the past. Oh my God, my face is really becoming some rough stuff. No, you're beautiful. Jacob, go thank that you. By wow, thank you. All right, now that the nut is tight. I should be able to get this, no problem. We've tightened up the nut, not even an issue. Uh, I'm not locked on for some reason, there we go. Let's go. Stop it. No stabs, please. Double roll that one. Get the rolls there. Avoid the anime teleport. We, we have no respect for, for weebs. Got him. What are you doing? Get out, get out, heal up. You don't want to be around when that goes off. Great. No, sir. No, sir. Okay, a little fast on that one, I see. Okay, you know, you got the big move. That's cool, I like that. Easy dodge, easy life. Come on, can you move towards the middle of the room, please? Can you move towards the middle of the room, please? 
No lasers. That's bad. Oh, go away. Go away. Dodge. Dodge. Oh, Commander Swippies is here. Dodge. Oh, no. I was doing so good. I was doing so good. No. That could have been it. I literally just mistimed. AP Mess, thank you for the sub. Phaeton824, thank you for the sub. Dr. Landshark, thank you for the sub. Thank you all very much. <sighs> I've definitely got it. Like, I'm getting the patterns down. It's just that if you do it bad, he will hit you very hard until you're dead. That's sort of the downside. That was the, the real practice round, because I feel like I got some really good practice in on that one. So it's not like a cannon attempt. This one, though, I'm hoping this will be the real the real attempt. We'll see. We'll see if this is the real attempt, or maybe it'll be like a fun, a fun, a one for fun, for funsies. <clears throat> Let's go. Okay, okay, all right, okay. Love it. Okay, all right. This is going really well, may I just say. Let's go. Can you stop getting so far away from me? Anime moves. True gamer hours over here. Double dodge, double hit. Oh, swirly boy. Oh, that didn't. That didn't. No, that didn't. I don't think that did. Stop, dude. This dude's got the power of God in anime on his side for sure. Get a couple wax, but don't get greedy. Whee! Whee! Come on. Come on. Come on, then. That was woefully mistimed. Don't do it again. Two hits. No, sir. What's the move? I disagree. I think that one was actually dodged. Okay, okay. You know, it's okay. I get it. You're mad. I see that. I see that you're mad. That one wasn't the real attempt. And I've got very good reasons for why that one wasn't the real attempt, but they're, they're very personal reasons, so I can't share them with you guys. Um, but they were, it is... That one wasn't real, but I have, it's like I said, it's, there's some personal stuff involved, so I can't really, I can't really share it. But just trust me that that one wasn't the real one. Sharpen knife for more damages. Oh, I forgot I could do that. How does that even work? I don't even remember how that works. Oh. 
Oh. Can I sharpen it again? Are there levels to this? <laughs> it doesn't matter if you get absolutely hit immediately. No, 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 no. Good lord. I can't believe I totally forgot that was a thing I could do. <laughs> Stupid as hell. Let's go. Let's not go. Don't swippy me. That time I was really focused on sharpening the knife. That was knife sharpening practice. So I practiced sharpening the knife that time. So I got that down. Uh, Zach every day subscribed and said, I just finished the Wah episode and I don't know what to do. I need answers. The only answers truly are the ones that you find in your own heart. Search yourself for answers. Go try and upgrade at Andre. I don't think I have the materials to upgrade. I don't think I have the upgrade materials. I mean, I can use... I can use the big hammer. We can try out big hammer again. Maybe I should bonk? I'm, I might try for some bonks. Maybe I'll do a bonk attempt, a bonk run. I do have to change up my armor in order to make that happen. The drang is usually pretty good for this. Drang it! Fallen Knight trousers, why not? And of course the big hat. This is gonna be bonk attempt. I think this will be good because um, I'm not warmed up with this one yet, with this weapon. So this attempt is going to be the warm up for this weapon. And the armor is different too, so that'll probably take a separate attempt to warm up with the armor. So I would expect like a couple more warm up attempts. <clears throat> Let's go. I would love to be not here. I don't think he should be able to use that move. I'm in a bad place. It's fine. Let's go. Come over here. Can we fight over here? Come over here. Okay, well not that fast. Don't. Don't do this. Don't do this one. Don't do this one. Okay, it's fine. Oh, are you kidding me, dude? This guy must be kidding me. This guy must be kidding me. Well, like I said, that was weapon warm up. So that one's not real. That one's not a real one. So that was the weapon warm-up. This one is the armor warm-up. 
So I got to get used to the new, like, because also the cape, you got to take into account how distracting the cape is that I'm wearing now. So that whole time I was, like, looking at the cape, and that was the problem. He resists frost. He is weak to thrust, lightning, and fire. Well, I don't have anything for that. I don't have anything for that. I could maybe fire enchant my my but can you even I don't think you can enchant the butcher knife, can you? We're going to go back. We're going to take it back. We're going to take it back to where we were. With this witchy look right here. Sharpen the blade. Well, now I have to warm up for this. Uh, that friggin' move, dude. That move literally hits me 99% of the time. Stop. You're being absurd. You're being obscene. No, sir. No, sir. Chug a lug. Let's go then. No dog. I guess yes dog, huh? What's next? Whoa! It's really an issue of if you get hit by one, you're gonna get hit by the other because you've already you've already messed up your dodge. You've already messed up your dodge at that point, and your life is over. You forfeit your life. Get greedy when he's summoning the phantom. Should I try doing some parries? Is that the answer? Is Perry the answer? Give him a little of that action. Give him a little bit of this. Do I have Buckler Shield? I've got the small leather shield and the round shield. I definitely don't have the buckler, which is unfortunate. Got a lot of shields, but not the buckler shield. Round shield works. Does that have the extended parry timing? I'm just going to try with the Dragon Crest shield because I'm scared. I'm a scared baby. All moves aren't parryable. Well, which moves are parryable? Small Leather has better parrying. Oh, there it is. That's the animation you want to see. We want that little little leather friend on our side. His jump charge at the start is a good parry.
All right, here we go. Here we go. Here comes the big parry. Oh! <laughs> Savagery on display. Nope. Not that one. Not that one. Not that one. Not that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that didn't go well. <laughs> I heard some victory, and then you had done a cool move to him, and then I looked back, and you were dead. Well, I was trying to figure out. <laughs> I was trying to figure out what I could parry, and I did parry his first move, and it was really cool. So, okay, you were trying something, so that one doesn't count. That one, yeah, I was that trying something count. new. It was yeah. practice. He was, was practicing. He was testing something. It doesn't count. So this one is another. This is parry practice part two. Do I have any resin? Probably, but I don't like to use resin. It makes me panicky. Nope. I don't know at all what's parryable. I don't know if this is a good strategy for me. This might not be the, the strategy for me. Because it's making me think, it's making me think too much about parrying and not enough about dodging. I think we'll get there. I think we'll get there with normal strategies. I will never summon an NPC, Jellyheart. Summon me. I'm like a handicap. You, that would be impossible unless you get the game now and then make it to this point in the next hour. You could. <laughs> but yeah, I like to fight the bosses 1v1. And whoever was joking about me not engaging with all the game mechanics, that's absolutely true. Disrespect. Forgot to sharpen? That's fine. Let's go. Oh. Okay. All right, sassy. Good. I think I can just walk under that second one if I was was a uh, patient. Oh, not this. Not this. Not this one. It's a million moves long. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I can walk right under that. And if he doesn't sass master me, I can get extra hits there, potentially. All right, got an anime. Get away from that. Chug a lug. Oh, I didn't expect you to hit. That is actual horse shit. God, get off my nuts, dude. Bad, bad, bad. Very bad. Oh, come on, man. Get out. All right.
Go away. Go away. No, sir. Oh! I don't think killing the ghost is a good strategy because he can make another one. And the ghost kind of helps in certain ways because the ghost telegraphs what he's about to do. Focus the ghost, then he's making another hit the main hard. That's a potential option. I am playing on PC, a Dane's war chief. All right, this time we're going to make our sword sharp. We're going to make our sword sharp and angry. Sir. I can't believe you would sass me like this from the get-go. Double dodge. Double hit. No, sir. Big spins. Sassy move. Walk under that one. Double hit. Take the free heal. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm so scared. Okay, I'm fine. Let's go, gamer. Oh, that's hacks, dude. <sighs> they literally destroyed me. I was destroyed. I've been made fool of this day. All right, I think I'm going to do a few more attempts. And then if I don't get it, um, we will go to do like one of the other areas, just so we're seeing something that's not just this the whole stream. I mean, I've beaten this guy before, because I've played this game before. But I do recall that last time I played, I was stuck on him for a very long time. I'm not going to summon. I'm not going to use fire bombs. The fun of these games for me is just doing like a straight up 1v1. You swung the wrong way, dude. That's just how I like to play. What are you doing? That's a two hit punish on that one. Come on. This is fair. Don't sass me. Get out of there. Big 
Very bad. Very bad. Alright. That's alright. Don't know why I didn't dodge that one. Let's go. Let's go. That is what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Oh, <laughs> brutal. Seems like if I can bait out the big dot. Oh, don't, no, yes. Yes. Correct. If I can bait out the big dive, um, I can punish that very easily. Let's go, gamers. What's the move? I don't like that move. I don't like that move. That move I do like. What? You can't do that! You're cheating! You're cheating! No! No! God damn it. You all saw that, right? He cheated. <laughs> you saw him cheat. I don't think I said Waxillium and Wayne gifted a sub to Pizza Hats. Thank you so much. Oh, God. Okay. Do I have any more coffee? I do. Do you want more coffee? There's more. No, I'm all right. Thank you. I was close that time. I was really close. I will never ember. I will never ember. I will never summon. I will never parry again. <laughs> I will never do any strategy that is known to be effective. Firebombs? No, thank you. It's never good when he sasses me right off the bat. Ooh, kind of tripped me up there. Little trick -a No, sir. No trick -a please. No trick -a Ran out of juice. Ran out of hitting juice. Do the big thing. Why do I have such a hard time dodging that? This is bad. This is bad for baseball player. Oh, frig. I can't see anything. What is going on? I cannot see. I'm blind. <laughs> That was camera. That was camera percent run right there. They put me in the impossible vision zone and pranked me out of life. Julia, I'm sorry. Do I keep disturbing you? No, it's fine. I keep just... I keep just wanting to see what's happening with all the, the yelling. I mean, this is a this is a Yeller's game. This is a Yeller's game, yeah. They should call this one Old Yeller, because I'm old and I'm yelling at a game. 
<laughs> this right here is old yeller. All right. I'm going to sharpen my blade this time. I'm going to remember to do that this time. This blade will cut. This blade will kill. Will this blade kill? Yeah. Don't sass me. Oh, he got his little hand. Oh, he's doing the bad thing. Oh, he's doing a little sword dance. That's lovely. We don't like the bad thing. Oh, well, it's a pretty dance. Let him do ballet. It's really pretty, yeah, but... Let him ballet. If he hits me with even a single part of it, I will perish from this earth. Let him ballet, let him sashay. Mm. 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 He's sassing me. Mm. Double dodge. Two hits. This is what I look like when there's a bug in the house. And it's eluding me. Except now I just grab one of the cats. Cats. No, sir. Let's go. Do you think this man is so angry because he gets a lot of tall jokes? There goes the weather up there, Pontiff. That's the move. Pontiff Sully. Beautiful. That's bad. Owie. Owie. He done smacked me. I'm going to run full ass away. Yeah, run full ass away. Oh. oh. Oh, he did a big leap. Interesting how he flew three times further than his shadow did. Yeah. Isn't that fun? I think that's a pretty fun trick to do. Really thought he wasn't going to fly across the entire uh, fighting arena. That was hacks. Didn't count. He did full ass dunk me. He did dunk you. He was slam dunking Benedetto up in here. Have I listened to the new Covet album yet? Is it out, RX Bonanza? You piece of shit. Are you kidding me? There's never been a better month to be out than June. Damn, that's true. So I'm happy for Covet. Covet's album. Um, I am going to listen to it. They rule. Ginkgo Bilboa. Bil Biloba. Biloba. Gifted two tier one subs. Thank you very much. <laughs> these subs. With the power of these subs, I will succeed. We will defeat this dancing pontiff. Double dodge, double hit. It is a pontiff. Like a Ponzi scheme? Like pontificate? Is it one who pontificates? Could I explain fish food ice cream? Okay. I'm going to explain to you fish food ice cream. Fish food ice cream is wonderful. It's the best ice cream ever in the world. It is basically chocolate ice cream with marshmallow and caramel and these little choco chips in the shape of fishies. And so what I like to do is I like to eat around the chocolate chip fishies and then leave them to the end. And then I just have a heaping spoonful of chocolate fishies and I pop them in my mouth and then they melt because they're milk chocolate. Mm. Fish food's wonderful. It's the best ice cream ever. This is bad. Oh, it's not that bad. My general sort of position is bad. Yeah, I mean, you're on the altar. Which, unless you're there for a wedding, not a very fun place to be. Just took that one full in the dome. I'm going to sharpen my blade right in front of you, dude. Do something. Yeah, threaten him with it. It's a power move. Oh! oh. He did a little sneaky. He did a little sneaky. That move hits so hard. It hits so hard. That was three fourths of my health. I need to practice my de escalation skills. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what's going to help. Yeah. I 
I know I said I was going to try something else after a few attempts of this, but I feel like I'm close. I feel like I'm getting so close. And I know I probably should focus on the ghost, but I feel like if I try to hit the ghost, oh, man. he's like, because he's always there with that secondary attack. Focus on the ghost on the altar, man. You know what I mean? Aren't we all like focused on the ghost Sharpen on the altar? Sharpen my good knife. Aren't we Got all? my good knife going. Jacob, I'm here to uh, to check chat for you so you can focus on game, on gaming. I appreciate that. That's very kind of I'm you. I'm here for you. Hmm. Mm. Interesting. Dance Macabre has some words of, of motivation for you. Wow, dude, you're popping off right now. Slam a Capri Sun. I don't like that you can't see your shadow right now. It's because it wasn't there yet. Oh, oh piss on me. This piss is bad. Oh. Shot through the heart. All right. Oh, they're leaping into the air. Whoa! Oh, Jacob. Oh, Jacob. See, that's the issue with being really close, is that if they both get into that combo, there's just like nothing you can do. You're just like stuck in hell. <sighs> that close up combo is brutal. So most of me watching ja Jacob play Sekiro was me sitting in the background going, for things exactly like that. It was close. I mean, I'm it was definitely close. getting- It was close, you were one hit away. I'm getting much better at the fight. Like first phase is going really quick, these yeah. past few attempts. What attempts? They were practices. These past few practices. Cause this one, uh, first try. People are still talking Ben and Jerry's in the chat. From what I remember, Ben and Jerry have always been in the news for just getting arrested at protests for, you know, for uh, fighting for people's rights. Ben and Jerry's whips ass about that. They really do. Like, they've always been so vocal about, you know, getting people out of prison who are there on marijuana charges and just fighting for civil liberties always and it's always like they always use their company to make a very uh tasteful message about it but then their owners will go out and protest and themselves can y'all chill they're doing the dance the dance macabre We're good. Are we all in AOC's district? No, unfortunately not. A kick? <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> this is really bad. This is fine. This is fine. No. I love that he kicked. God damn it. Yes. Gotta 
go. Not even coming near that. New. No. If you want to do that, you can do that on your own time. Yeah. No, Jacob and I are in Brooklyn. She I believe is in the Bronx. Come on. She's up there. Come on, baby. Come on, baby cakes. I wish I was in AOC's district. Come on, baby cakes. Come on, my sweet precious child. My precious plum. Let's go. Get out. This was a trap. This was a trap. No, <laughs> sir. Yeah. Oh. Bad, bad, bad. Bad, bad, bad. <sighs> Fucking God, dude. The Bronx and the Brook uh, the Bronx and the Brooklyn are not the same. Bronx is north of Manhattan. I mean, yeah, Bronx is north of Manhattan. Brooklyn is east of Manhattan. We Brooklyn is technically on Long Island. Don't tell that to people who live in Brooklyn and have been born and raised here. But we got it this time. Should be further away to bait the big leap attack. I will give that a try. Oh, let's uh, sharpen up. I feel like the threat generated by sharpening. Queens is basically Long Island. Ask me, dude. It is on Long Island. What is happening? He's doing a little little twists and turns. Sometimes he does some weird shit. Yeah, uh oh. This is a bad corner to be in. <clears throat> I hate the bad dance. The bad dance sucks. Ah, T public ships to Australia. Very nice. I'm happy to hear that. I'm sorry for everyone where T public doesn't ship to you. Happy belated birthday to Hot Damler. Unbelievable the hot damn did not tell us after they gifted so many subs so nicely. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Long Island the island and Long Island the region are two different things. That's bad. I think that Queens and Brooklyn count more towards like the city and Long Island doesn't, but it's like Queens and the Bronx, aren't they just counties of Long Island? Just like Nassau and Suffolk? I don't know, it's dumb. Come on, man. <laughs> this little crouch walk you're, you're doing. Come on, man. Shit. Oh, they're boroughs of New York City. Okay, thank you, Liz. But Queens and Brooklyn are geographically on the map. Did 
that trick again. Get out. Get out of here. Get the fuck out of here, dude. Yay! Get the fuck out of here. Hell yeah. yeah. First try. First try, baby. From this angle, you look like a little grandma <sighs> with the big hat and the. You look like a grandma who's about to work in the garden. That was a real attempt right there. Yeah. That was a real. I really tried that time and I think it showed. First try. You know, it's a real attempt because I was like, my head was receding back to my body, just going, just do it. Just, just, just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Oh boy, let's go spend some souls. Let's go spend some souls. I'm going to go back to my computer. Thank you for your support. But you're welcome. During Wax this trying Wayne time. Subscribe. Thank you, Wax Lemon Wayne, with the first try subscription. Are you hot? No, I'm good. Yeah, you are. <laughs> oh my god. It's the nerdy ninja was asking Julia before you go. He said, I want to move to New York. What are the pros and cons? Uh, it depends where in New York you want to move. If you're moving to like the Manhattan area, you should know that it's very expensive. Um, really expensive and very small living spaces for a lot of money. Yeah, very expensive, very tiny apartments. Um, the pros are, if you live in the Manhattan area, that you... So Queens alone has more... Uh, has, like, some of the densest... I could have upgraded. Uh, <laughs> it has like the amount of the, I, I forgot what the exact term is but like more countries around the world are represented in uh, Queens than anywhere else I think Um, so you get like so much exposure to so many cool cultures from around the world and you get to eat so many cool foods from around the world and that's what I love about it because then you also get like the people from those countries and you get to you know I don't know, learn so much. I genuinely love New York. Um, if you move outside of the Manhattan area, like upstate, just know that taxes are really high here. Um, but do know that we have a wonderful Medicaid system in New York, relatively. It's pretty good. But those are my pros and cons. Is everything's expensive, but... And everything feels like a fight, but then you feel stronger for it in the end. It's really the kind of place where if you live here and it clicks with you, it's like very hard to imagine living anywhere else. Yeah. It's hard for me to always answer that question because I have been born and raised here and I just kind of know where I fit in. Yeah. New York feels very make or break you, but I genuinely love New York and it's hard for me to imagine living anywhere else. Yeah. Like I've, right now at this point in my life, I wouldn't want to live anywhere else. Moke gore, I don't think you can put heavy on butcher knife. I think it's got like its own weird set of properties that let you not infuse it. Yeah, it's not one of the ones you can infuse for whatever reason. <clears throat> All right, I'm going back. Anyway, I Somebody hope that- Somebody in chat, I think, put it really well when they said, uh, moving to New York, pros, everything. Cons, everything. Yeah. New York is just a very, it's, it's up here. It's a high. Yeah. All the bars are pushed to the maximum. Yeah. The problems are worse, but the benefits are worse too. I mean, better. The highs are higher, the lows are lower. Yeah. It's a big spectrum. I'm going to run ads because everyone's yelling at me <laughs> in a positive way. The city feels very like it wants to break you, but everyone comes together to kind of make it work relatively. And that's fun. Running ads now. All right, we got ads going. Joy's in a perfect little ball over here. Oh, she's precious. I feel like it also depends on the things that you value too. Yeah. Like for me, it's really, I really value having access to like lots of different types of food, lots of different types of people, lots of different types of situations and experiences, like all within either walking distance or a short train ride away. Also, if you live here, a lot of our museums are free for you. 
You got to say that into the microphone. If you live here, a lot of our museums are free for you. That's true. If you use your New York State ID, and like you can get into the Met for free or MoMA or anything like that. But and also, if you got you know friends in the city, it's so much easier just to like maintain friendships. Just pop New on York. a train and meet somewhere. Well, you don't even have to for like yeah. depending on where you live. Like I've got a lot of friends that live in my area. Yeah. Like they're like oh. a fifteen minute walk away max. And so if you want to hang out, you can just text someone and be like, hey, what are you doing? You want to yeah. hang out? And then just yeah. walk over there or walk and meet somewhere. Like it's... Hello. That part I would really miss if I left. Hey, you. We have a visitor. Oh, it's Olive. The sweetest cat of them all. The sweetest kitty. The sweetest kitty who was just having a bite to eat. Olive is so good. She's such a good cat. She's just very nervous. She's just a nervous, shy cat. And the only bad thing that she does is that she's so shy that I feel bad doing anything to her. And also, she sometimes scratches at the furniture. Yeah. But that's it. But that's it. You're such a good kitty. I just always think about, like, New York, too. You can do things like, well, before it was quarantine. Yeah. Before everything changed and the fire nation attacked yeah um like if it's like spring or summer like me and julie would be like we're gonna you know walk over to a one of the bars that has outdoor seating yeah and like you know grab a drink and sit outside and like we can do that and then be like i'm just gonna text several people and, see and say come by. hey we're going to this bar and we're gonna be here for a while come by if you aren't doing anything and more often than not people will just come by they'll just be like oh i'm not doing anything i'll just go hang out just walk on over and that kind of like casual hangout is hard to do in other places you don't have to make a plan you can just toss it out there and then it's very nice yeah it's a great city i love it i also love our our public library system yeah that's, I know that's also a weird great. thing no it's not i mean that's a that's really important it's so good and there are branches just like legitimately everywhere it's great Right, Olive? Olive purring. Ads are done. Olive purring. Olive's purring because she knows the ads are done. Um, I'm going to get back to the game. What are you doing? Oh, baby. Let's level up. Welcome home. Oh, I'm still like coming down from the adrenaline of that boss fight. <laughs> yeah. This game really makes you like tense up your whole body. And then when it's done, I'm just like, oh. LF, LF Pneumatic says, are you guys hanging out with people? No. No. We don't. It's not worth the risk. No, it's not. I desperately want to see my parents, and I haven't seen them. Some of us can't see our parents because they live across the country. Yeah. Julia. Yeah. Check your parent privilege. <laughs> I miss my parents. Your feelings are invalid. <laughs> <laughs> a Drafi fan just met my father, so that's fun. You know that according to the internet, you're only allowed to feel something if you have the most extreme version of that feeling possible. Yeah. yeah Unless yeah, yeah. you have it the absolute worst, you're not allowed to feel any negative feelings. Jacob, have you been reading the DMs I've been getting on Twitter? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mythic Box asked, how difficult is the learning curve for Dark Souls? I'm intrigued by the lore stuff and whatnot, but I'm also bad at these kind of games. Um, it's difficult to say because it's really difficult right at the start. The first time you pick one up, it's like, it seems like impossible to play, but you do hit a point where you like crest the hill and you start playing the way the game kind of wants you to play. You start like understanding what it's asking of you. And once you've done that with one of the games, then every Souls game and every Souls like is basically follows the same principles. So you can like play any of them pretty well if you know how to play one of them. Uh, so that's kind of my answer. It's like if you if you feel if you feel like making the upfront effort investment to get into it, then you can do all of them. And and then for most people that I know that play these games, once they play one and get it, it becomes like one of their favorite series. Like I don't know many people that don't 
love these games once they get into it. Bloodborne, I think, has one of the hardest first three hours of any of them. So I don't know if I'd agree that it's a great starter one. Bloodborne's like first segment is really rough. I think Dark Souls 3 might be a good starting point for a lot of people. But I don't know. I could I could be uh I could have a different viewpoint on it. Bloodborne's probably one of my favorite ones. Dark Souls 1 is showing its age at this point. So it's always going to be my favorite. But if you try to pick it up now, it's definitely showing some age. <clears throat> so that might be difficult for a lot of people. Yeah, it's it's really it's really difficult to explain because it literally is Runcible Shaw. Like if you get into the game, you get into the game. There's no but there are so many people I know. I feel like the reason I say it is because there's so many people I know that were like, I wouldn't like this game or I can't play this type of game. And then they they crest the hill on it and are like, I can't stop thinking about this game. And like, all I want to do is play it. Because it is very satisfying execution wise once you start getting into it. That's it. That's all I have to say. Let's go talk to our little friend and see what kind of cool stuff he has for us. Drawn McG, I'm not the best one to ask about Dark Souls 2 because I don't really like it at all. I think it's like totally good as an action RPG, but it doesn't really feel like a Dark Souls game to me. And I was so in love with the first one that it really sort of put me off. But a lot of people very much disagree with me on that and love Dark Souls too. And I don't think they're wrong. I just think that I have a particular viewpoint on it. Profaned Greatsword. Greatsword of Judgment. This guy got two Greatswords? That one seems like it's the the strengthier one. Profane sword lights on fire. This is his right hand sword. Summon the profaned flame. One of them is an ultra great sword. You think I should take profaned great sword? That's probably what I'll do. I'm gonna take profaned. This great sword says fuck when you swing it. I wish somebody would release. Damn, young Belook and Fly literally said the exact same sentence I said as I said it. Same, same brain, same idea. I just want someone to mod that into the game now. Uh, a profaned great sword. Ooh, look at this fancy sword. All right, I like the overhead. Big sweeps. Ooh, that was a little... Ooh, look at that fiery stab. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Spicy. That's fun. 
I kind of want to play with it, but I feel like I need to upgrade it to make it any good for me. It's definitely not going to do as much damage. L2, then R2. Oh, mamma mia. Oh, it's on fire. Oh, we live in fire town. We live in Fireland. Now this is a fun time. This is a fun time for me. I'm having a wonderful experience. Wowie wow. Do I have anything to upgrade this with? Andre. I only have one Titanite scale. I need more FP though. Yeah. I'm gonna keep it in mind for later when I have more materials. Gonna go back to my good old fashioned butcher's knife for now. I ain't done me wrong, ain't steered me wrong, ain't done nothing, ain't done nothing, ain't wrong with me, damn daggum. This knife right here, did get me through everything. Because I'm not getting more FP. Let's be real, you guys. That goes in the category of things I'm not going to do. I don't want no FP. If you ask me, FP stands for forget this points. Because forget about it. Julia, everybody in chat keeps talking about how you, like, will slowly turn your head to look at me <laughs> as I'm saying things. <laughs> You're saying some wild things. No, I'm not. I'm saying normal things that every human says. Play your game. I am playing my game. Play your game. Don't, You're the one who took me out of it. Don't look at me. Don't speak to me. Don't think of me. Don't think of me softly. Oh, lizards. Talking? Yeah, I was making a Phantom of the Opera reference for you. What? Think of me fondly. I said, I said don't think of me softly. Are, does she say define... softly in it, or does she just say fondly? She says fondly. She never says softly? You're thinking of killing me softly. Oh, you're right. You're definitely right. Which I also do love, so it's a good song. Killing me softly with his song. <laughs> Oh, this is giant land. These giants got up to some some stuff. Oh, These giants got up to some business. Are they snoozing? Which one of these guys is going to stomp me out of existence when I grab this item? None. None, guys. <laughs> Don't cast on me. I see you up there. I see you up there trying to cast on me. Don't do it. Oh, it's double hammers, man. Oh my God, everyone is here. Everyone is here and they're so mad. They're so mad at me, dude. What did I do to you? I'm gonna sharpen my blade on you. Come on. I'm gonna eat you alive, dude. Oh, you want to swing hammers at me? All right, that actually did hurt. But you are dead now, unfortunately. What you got for me? Anything? Nothing. All right, oh, let's go oh. two spears. Let's go two chains. This dude looks like Kylo Ren. Let's go, Kylo. What you got? Okay, well, you're hacking because you got the fireman on your team. This is hacks, dude. This guy can cast so many fireballs so fast. Don't, don't you do it, man. 
Don't you do it, bud. Ow. Stop. Stop! Okay, dude. Let's get that guy out of here. Oh, there's three of them. That's why they can cast so fast. Yeah, I did just get invaded by Ben Dover. Got the twin spears. I'm going to leave this area before I fight this man. This is not the place that I want to do battle. I will face him down here. We will fight like gentlemen. Sharpen my blade. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, whoops. I want to bow. Where's my bow? There it is. A duel then! Woo! Spinneroonie! Let's go. Wowie! Gonna gobble you up, baby! That's a bad. That's a bad. Had a baby, it's a bad. Bad trades, bad trades. He got me fair and square. Good game, bend over. Good game. Yeah, that was PvP. He invaded me. Now, you know what? That was a gentleman's duel. A gentleman's fight. And he won. And I, I give that to him. You got to give it to him. Crystal Lizard. Oh, you're going down, brother. Give me your crystals. Thank you. But it's cool because I already killed old Twin Hammers, Kylo Ren. No, Twin Spears, Kylo Ren. I think the invades are kind of fun because I've played these games so much. If I were a new player, it would not be good for me. But as an old player, I don't super care if I die. So it's fine. Julia's playing Metro Exodus. I'm about to go up and whoop these dudes' ass. Giant, I have no quarrel with you. I do take umbrage with with these fellows, however, who have been uh, mistreating me as I've been engaging in combat. Ooh, what's this? Deacon skirt! Now I can look like a cute little deacon. Let's go. Nope. I have instincts. I'll never be harmed. I'll never be harmed. I have ultra instinct. I'm Goku Ultra Instinct. That's bad. I'll never be harmed. I'm invincible. My speed is unparalleled. Not even a big boy. Oh, look at that. Look at you, bud. Good job. Got him. 
Can we get a wardrobe change soon? That's that's a good point. Robadair. Robadair. Doesn't open from this side. This one doesn't open from this side. We built this whole big castle, but we made all the doors only open from one side. It's real confusing to navigate. That's my impression of the guy who made this castle. Don't! I feel like there was stuff down here I didn't see or get. I don't really want to fight the giant. I do want this. I do want this. Looks like there's stuff in here. What's in here? What's going on in here? Oh, it's these guys. Get out of here. Hate these guys. You're dead. You're already dead. You don't even realize it. Dark stone plate ring. What does that do? Increases dark damage absorption. Unfortunately, that's incredibly boring. So I will be disregarding it immediately. Wow, look at the view. You ever seen a view like that in all your days? Captain Buckaroo said, I've been skipping these streams because I thought I hate Dark Souls, but I guess I forgot I love Jacob, so that doesn't matter. Thank you so much, Captain Buckaroo. That's very sweet. Where am I right now? Oh, I'm up on the other side. I see. Wow. That's incredible how that works out. We love architecture. I will be accepting this item. A large Titanite shard. You know I like them large. Live in large with a large shard. That corner was really suspicious, Kyokobi. I, I gave it a, a big look around. Do I want to fight that giant? Do you think he's going to have anything good for me if I fight him? I have to know for sure. Sharpen up! Hello? Come here. Come here, buddy. Come here. It's okay. Come here. Oh, dang. I hit your legs. I hit all your legs really hard. I'm sorry. All that for a Titanite shard. Mira K asked, how's Motor Ed doing? Has he been having any engine troubles or has it been a smooth ride? He was having some engine troubles. His face, he's having some face troubles. I'll be honest with you there. Um, he's having some... Truly incredible face troubles, but his his power engine, his combat engine, is running at full capacity. On the inside, he's never been more powerful than he is right now. Okay, so I think... 
which way do I want to go? Let's go in here. What's going on in this room? That's a blood stain. Let's see how they died. Looks like they were doing some swings and they got hit. They got hit one too many times and died. You know, that'll happen. But what was he fighting? Did you want to check out the upstairs of the pontiff room? I heard you. Oh, my ear powers are incredible. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see that ear dodge? Amazing. I do want to check out the other way first. That was some spidey senses shit for sure. The secret room behind the fog wall. I'm not sure I know what that is. But I don't know. There are many things I do not know. Now this is some stuff. This is some stuff in here. Yeah, you take fall damage in this game, Panini Press Peach. It can and will kill you. What does this lever do? Nothing, I guess. What does this button do? Oh, it's an elevator. I can come down and look at all the destruction I caused in this room. Actually, it looks like they put it back together. Who came in here and put this room back together? Who rebuilt all of these intricate pews? Since I was in here having a big fight with an angry preacher. In the room where you found a blood stain, there is a fog wall. Okay. I will go back there. Just looking around up here first, making my way downtown. Something over there? No. Oh, Mimic Town. Welcome to Mimic Town. Wish me luck, guys. You know what happens when I try to face the Mimic. Wait, do I have any of those things you can throw at it that make them just, like, go to sleep? It's Lloyd's Talisman, right? Hold on. Hold your horses. Hunter's Charm. We're going to get him with the Hunter's Charm. Here you go. High-level strats. Whoop! Oh, he's sleepy. He's sleepy. Give me your item. I'll take your golden ritual spear and I will leave you for another time. You see that? Did you ever think I would do something so smart? I didn't think so. Bring it on up here. Get a nice little view. What does this say? Lizard ahead and then praise the ore. Yeah. Gotcha. A simple gem. It's a simple kind of gem. I did de-escalate that situation, fun and fancy. It's one of my many skills. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here this way. This is the get out of here way. Uh -huh. Killing the mimic or re-sleeping him has a chance to give the mimic helmet. 
I don't need that in my life right now. I can come back for it later. I'm really just trying to focus on me right now. You know what I mean? Motor Ed doesn't want to mimic anyone else. Motor Ed's got to figure out what makes Motor Ed Motor Ed. Secret wall. Secret wall. Secret wall. Oh. Big slide. Whee! Ooh, hello. I don't know if I like this room. Who's that? There's so many dogs in here. There's so many dogs in this room. All right. Stealth tactics. Oh, he saw. He knows. Come on, then. Oh. <laughs> this may be a bad time to sharpen my blade. <laughs> <laughs> that was not the best time to sharpen my blade. I maybe should have sharpened the blade before. Before then. That's okay. We have shortcuts now. It's a hard room. Thankfully, I'm, I almost said a hard gamer, and I want to go ahead and, and take that back before I even say it. I'm not under any circumstances a hard gamer. Got to go past the damn fire patrol over here. Damn fire force. Hit him with the bob and weave. Little bit of bob and weave. Don't. We're good. Let's go. I do really want that item that's sitting there. And I don't... What's the other thing in the room? Where's my... Where's my binocos? Put my binocos on the bar. Where's my binocos? There they are. I'm blind as hell, dude. Wrong button. Here we go. A covenant. Whoops. Why do I never remember which button zooms it in? Which button zooms it in? Ring of favor and protection? It's the D-pad. You're right. You got it. Thank you. You'd think since I tried every other button, I could have figured that out. Okay, I think we're gonna do a mad scramble for the items. Get the souls. Get the human drags. Speed run strats. Speed run strats. Deep gym. Oh God. Oh God. I was never going to live. I was never, ever going to live. You got to kill the dogs to get the good ring. I have to pee so bad. So I am going to do that. Julia heard, and she's coming to help you while I pee. Be right back. I'm here to help you while Jacob pee. Hi, everyone. I need to take inventory of what's going on with Motor Ed. 
Oh my god. Duh. What is on his face? Is that skin? What's going over the top of his face by his eyeballs? He's like a dehydrated skull. How do I... Okay. That's how I do. That's how I swing. Oh, it's so pretty. How's everyone doing? Fashion him up. Oh, okay. How do I get into the... I was just looking at what you got. You got some shiny gems. You're in my items? I'm in your items. That's my private stash. That's your private stash of items. Uh, here you go. Thank you. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go back to my game. Thank Bye. you. Wow, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. The chat is doing ellipses again. Why are they doing it this time? No reason. What did you do? Nothing. What did you tell them to do? Nothing. Why did you? Oh my <laughs> God, dude. What have you done? <laughs> oh, I can still roll though. This is actually a pretty dope look. You're like the holy Pillsbury Doughboy. Yeah, I can roll. I can roll with this. I can ride this. Guys, I'm going to be honest with you. I think I'm not going to fight those dogs right now. I spent like the first half of the stream dying repeatedly. To uh, one guy. And I don't want to spend the last 15 minutes dying repeatedly to two angry dogs. So I think I'll come back to the dogs at a later time. This is how I feel. I'm all out of faith. This is how I feel. Met Gala Dark Souls. Are you guys enjoying this flawless fire dodge technique? Oh, come on. Why do I say things? I was so close to being perfect. I could have been beautiful. What's going on around these parts other than a beautiful view of some lovely mountains and, and rivers? Item. Item. Titanite scale. I needed one of those. Love to see that. That's right. Big boy. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> That time I definitely did not call the shot. Is there gonna be an item around here? No, just a run up. Arr! All right, we got this. Oh Jesus! Here we go. I'm gonna drop down here. Go this way. Get that large Titanite shard. We sneak our way up here. Maybe we can lure. Hey. Don't you dare do it. 
I will not be treated this way. Oh, you don't care about me hitting you, huh? Alright. There's a time and a place for combat, and this is not that time, nor the place. These guys are so mad. Who got some ashes? Have you ever seen madder dudes than these guys? I'm gonna end your whole career. You disrespect me. This is what happens when you disrespect Motor Ed. You gotta go. Who else? You? Little tradesies, I like that. That's cute. That's cute. Do not disrespect. Silver Knight Helm. Oh, baby. No, dude. I don't think so. You're too slow. You're an embarrassment to your order of knights. What are you even doing in this corner? What are you guarding? What are you guarding right here? What is there to guard in this corner? There's nothing. Oh, a salty devil. Whoop. I've not been seen. Stealth tactics. Shadows die twice! Oh, big guy over here, big fella. Can I stealth you? Or are you gonna know? You have no idea. Oh, you have a spear. All right, come up here, please. All right, rude boy. Come up here, please. If you want to be rude, you're going to die rude. Live rude, die rude. See if I care. See if I care about it. A treat. What am I hearing right now? Hearing some nasty boys. This is that shortcut. I know a shortcut ladder when I see one. Beautiful. We've done it. The pirate buy, I wish we had iframes in real life. If I just like rolled at the right time, I could avoid any danger. There's an item over there. An item for me, Mota Ed. Oh, it's the Dragon Slayer Great Bow. I can actually use that because I'm very strong, right? Oh, I still need a lot of decks. I thought it was strong only. I have to go all the way down, huh? That's fine. I accept this. Any more items hiding over this way? Don't! 
These guys are so mad. Oh, I don't think so. I'm going to disagree with you on that one. Back in here. Up the ladder. Mayday Crash subscribe. Thank you so much. Also, Hibernation Dream and No Name Tag subscribed. Maybe Julia said one of those, but maybe she didn't. And I can't run that risk. Up we go! And down we go. Oh, this is that room from Dark Souls 1. Big statues and illusion wall. Oh yeah, just like Dark Souls 1, right? The more you know. Because this is where Gwen Avir, no, Gwendolyn, yes. This is where Gwendolyn's room was in Dark Souls 1. Oh, the brass set is so cool. Psyched to show you guys the brass set. I don't think there's even like a fight in here. I think it's just like a cool, a cool thing. This one's not a, no. Reversal ring. What does that one do? Males can perform female actions and vice versa. <laughs> you know you gotta put on a special ring if you're a guy, otherwise you can't perform female actions. There's just no way. What's over here? Pointless. Yeah, this is the Henri room, right? All right, I got to show off the brass armor. I think it's so cool. That brass, the brass, it is wildly heavy. Or is it? Oh man, it's so dope. What? Isn't this armor set so rad? Whoa. I love the fin. It's fin's really, super dope. It's really cool. Oh, I really like that. And I can still roll in it, so Motorhead's going to wear this for a bit. Wow. I love how it looks. Boy, howdy. Motorhead's coming up in the world. Armor set design drop you F will happen at some point, right? Julia would be really good at it. I would be really bad at it. Himba. You are coming with me to on Orlando, brother. Mayday Crash said, this is my first stream. What's the backstory for Motor Ed? I was just doing the, the random face thing. In Dark Souls, if you're making a character, you can click random face really fast and it will get like nastier and nastier looking. Um, and we ended up with a face, which you can't tell now because I've, died so many times and gone hollow. He looks like a gross leather man, but he looked a lot like uh, the singer from Motorhead. And so I named him Motor Ed and thought it was funny. That's it. 
Twizix90 asks, as a non-Dark Souls player, doesn't it matter what armor you wear? I mean, Jake has been changing it left and right, which is cool, but doesn't it make the game more difficult? Um, technically, you can, like, if you wanted to, try and, like, maximize choosing the right armor for the right, uh, like, situation. Like, they have different resistances, different blocking percentages and stuff like that. But I usually play the game where I'm not using a shield and I'm just dodging all the time. So it doesn't really matter as much what armor you wear if you play that way. So I usually just pick whatever I think looks good as long as it doesn't affect my dodge. If that answers your question. The first time I played Dark Souls 1, I definitely had like the biggest, heaviest armor I could find. It's fashions for me. Twizix, but you can play it legit and pay attention to it, and it will make the game easier for you. I just don't care if it's a little harder in the name of fashion. On Orlando, baby! Wow, wow, wow. I thought this was so cool the first time I played Dark Souls 3. And seeing the name pop up and everything, it was such a throwback. I see you over there, Silver Knight, walking up those stairs. I'm coming to get you, baby. What's up, bud? Oh, little lightning guy. That's cute. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm not going to fight both of you. I'll tell you right now. One of you is going to have to do the little reverse walk back up where you came from. Guys. Guys. We can't do this. Get him. Oh, I was going to try to get in the backstab. You guys are acting ridiculous right now. Who are you? They really want to fight together, huh? Voidhearted subscribed. Thank you so much. All right. We're not going to do that. I'm not going to do that with you. You disrespect me in this way? This door doesn't open, right? Locked by some contraption. You guys can hang out down there and do whatever you want. This is where the giant blacksmith was, and he still is. Damn. Sad. Giant blacksmith is the chillest guy in Dark Souls 1. All he wants to do is blacksmith. And he wonders where everybody went, and he's lonely. I feel like it probably says something lore-wise that they built Lothric Castle up higher than on Orlando, which was the land of the gods. That probably means something, right? Placing yourself higher than the gods. Surely that would not precede a catastrophic downfall. That is some fun hubris, Yum Barry. Who are you? Sportsmaster Flex, thank you for subscribing. Said, hey folks, you all have helped me get through some capital R, capital T, rough times. I really appreciate it. Glad we could help. Glad the chat could help. All of you have helped us get through rough times as well. Doing streams and hanging out with everyone makes, makes things a lot nicer. Seeing people be good and chill to each other. I 
I guess the stream ends soon, huh? Is um is Nathan streaming today? Or Carolyn? It's nasty in here. This is a nasty room. Carolyn's about to stream soon. Oh, fire boys. The fire boys are on it. But they won't get me before I open the front door. Don't stop me now. I'm having such a good time. Once the spiral tower is all the way razors and invisible. Oh! oh god, no. Oh no. Please. <laughs> Oh no! Oh heavens! Oh heavens! Oh no! Things are bad! <laughs> I didn't like that, mister! I didn't like- don't look at me like that! You're the one who did it! Um, so you're saying I can make the thing go higher, is what you're telling me. This contraption does not move. Or do I go down now? Is that what you're telling me? Are you telling me I can go this way? I'm not going to fall and die if I walk this way? This is an invisible bridge? If I fall and die, I'm going to be so salty. Oh my god, dude. It's happening. It's happening. Where does it go, though? How do I know when it stops? <sighs> He's done it. Oh, hey. There's a friend over here. Oh, you got a weird looking face, huh? Oh, you're like related to Priscilla because you got the, the dragon tail. Name thyself, stranger. The name's Moda Ed. Captain of the Dark Moon Knight. Yorshka. What there can be to such a place? I've got your spear. Do if nothing. If thou come stumbling here in error, I bid thee leave anon. This tower is a prison. Thy presence shall invoke the ire of the tyrant Sullivan. Oh, shall it invoke the ire of Sullivan? It is rare delight to converse with another. I don't think he's got any ire left on account of I did murder him. May the dark moon watch over thee. Thou thinks to remain. Yeah, I killed Sullivan with my big knife. Soon. Thy presence shall invoke the ire of the tyrant Sullivan. I bid thee leave anon. May the dark moon watch over thee. All right, well, listen. I'm telling you, I straight up killed that man. I, I did incur a great deal of his ire already, John McGee. Drawn McG. But he's got no ire left to hit me with. Boop. Love these dropping puzzles. Eh. Painting Guardian's curved sword. Fun. Eh. Those are connected, right? Yeah. 
Oh, the full painting guardian set. Love it. I see that other item. It's going to go on this pole here. Oh, perfect landing. It's going to go. I thought I saw an item. Maybe I didn't. It's going to go here. It's going to go here. Gonna go here. Gonna go here. Could this be a jumping off? Could be. It definitely could be. Boink. But where am I right now is a good question. Oh. I'm back down here. Oh, that's fun. All right, cool. This is probably a good place to end the stream then. Uh, so I'll be back with more Dark Souls on Friday. And until then, I won't be playing Dark Souls. But uh, we will be streaming on Sunday. Actually, Sunday, I think we're going to be... Um, B. John Steven is doing a charity stream of some kind. And I think we're going to be on that. So I'll let you guys know the details, but I think we're going to be on that on Sunday instead of streaming. So we'll update you on Twitter and everything and, and uh, let you all know what's going on. But that should be a lot of fun. And other than that, I'm going to raid Carolyn. Let's get in there. Am I spelling that right? We're going to hope so. I did it. Incredible job. Thanks, everyone, for hanging out. This was a lot of fun. We'll see you all next time. Please be safe. And have a good pride. Bye-bye.